This is Ralph Irvin at Easton Stadium where Friday night the UCLA Bruins opened their NCAA tournament play with an 11-4 win over St. Mary's. His UCLA assistant coach, Lisa Fernandez. Great way to start the tournament. I mean, this is what it's all about at this point in time. Uh, any team in the opposite dugout can get it done, and so we have to stay on our A game and take no opponent lightly. We have to go out there and continue to play our style of ball, and that's to continue to attack and to back each other up. We're strong on all ends of the, of the field, whether it's offensively, we can get the job done with either the long ball or putting down a bunt and getting the key base hit, or you know, defensively and in the circle. Um, we've got a great pitching staff that can back each other up, and you know, I think. What doesn't get a lot of credit on this team is just the defense that we have. You know, Monica uh, Harrison at shortstop has just been tremendous. Uh, Julie Burney at third. I mean, those guys are just mainstays over there, uh, being able to make some plays. And even Danny Uden at first base, being able to dig balls out of the dirt. This is a long haul. I mean, this isn't just a one weekend kind of thing. I mean, we're in it for the next three or four weeks, however long it takes. And so we're going to need everybody. And uh, from the get go, we knew that the team's strength was going to be its depth. And so we're going to continue to play everybody and, and give everybody an opportunity to be out there. You know, it was great to see Marty Reed be able to come in here and get a couple of hits and put the ball in play and, and do well. And that's what it's going to take. It's going to take every Bruin on that bench uh, to be able to, you know, play a big part on this team, whether they're a starter or not. Depth is going to be our strength. The Bruins were paced offensively by first baseman Danny Uden, who had two home runs. I just saw like something up in the zone, and once it was up in the zone, I was like, all right, cool. And then the other one was down in the zone. and So you can read angles, and since we're all like, there's a lot of lefties on our team, we all are seeing from the same, from the same vantage point. And so since we have that, we have a lot of information that we can pass down. And once we, like, once we do have that, we can give it to the next person and they can take it and make it their own and then they can just do what they can do from there. It's definitely different than what we've been seeing. We've been seeing the same team three times in a row, like Friday, Saturday, Sunday, we've seen the same team. And this one is, um, it's more exciting. Like it's a different picture, it's a new game. You can get, it's gonna be su such a different team and it's gonna be a new atmosphere every single at bat. And it's just gonna be, It's this is what postseason is about. Once again, UCLA an 11-4 winner over St. Mary's in their NCAA tournament opener. The Bruins are back in action on Saturday at 1 o'clock when they host San Diego State. Of course, the best news and notes on UCLA softball, you get it all right here at UCLABruins.com.